Okay, I'm uh, James McKenzie, shepherd owner of the Pipe and Glass at South Dalton. First of all, normally woken by uh, our two kids very early in the morning, um, which starts the day. You don't really need an alarm clock when you've got two small children. And then over in the pub, first people, uh, chefs start arriving about 8 o'clock, come across here then. Uh, first deliveries come, milk, cream, veg deliveries early in the morning. We are looking for quality, it's what we, what we want, you know, it's not just about using local produce, it's not lip service paid to that, it's about quality. So everything that comes in is the right thing that we've ordered, it's the right spec, it's the quality. Because if we have the right things coming in through the back door, we don't have to then mess about with them for the finished product that we serve to the customer. And it makes our jobs easier to have good suppliers, good produce coming in through the back door, so it's stored correctly, it's prepared correctly, and then it's it's presented correctly as well, and the customer ultimately has a better experience. Other chefs start to arrive between nine and a half past. Busy prepping all morning, the chefs in the kitchen cooking, I'm there, start a job, normally get called away doing different things, as in not just being a chef, as in running a business as well. Service starts at 12 o'clock, so everything's gotta be finished, done by then. Front of house wise, somebody comes in early on to answer the phone and uh, I do breakfast as well for our two rooms. Then the rest of the front of house team come in at about uh, 10 o'clock. So they're setting up everything, making sure everything's ready, setting up the bar. And that's what you want it to feel like when people come in through the door, that they're coming into your home and you just want to look after them. You know, and that's, it's personal, you know. Uh, as a lot of people will tell you in this industry, it's a lifestyle and uh, it is personal and that's when you care about people what they say and their comments and everything you know and you just genuinely want people to leave happy we start service at 12 o'clock doors open people flood through the doors hopefully that's the plan uh, our, our service is between 12 and 2 we serve the food uh, until 2 o'clock then we do a, a light uh, menu through the afternoon as well. We, we clean down in the afternoon after lunch service no prep goes on through service time it's merely for service and then start prepping for the night time again. Service starts again at six o'clock, so everything's there ready for six o'clock and then we serve through till half past nine. On an average uh, weekday, we'll do between 60 covers for lunch and dinner. Then cranks up a little bit for a weekend for about 100 covers on a Friday night and uh, about 100, 120 on a Saturday lunch and the same on a uh, Saturday dinner. And then on a Sunday lunch, we serve 12 till 4, we'll do anywhere between 160, 180 covers for them. So we're busy all, all the way through, really. Michelin Pub of the Year 2012 was awarded that. Obviously, we have a Michelin star as well, but uh, the awards are our main focus. We've just focused on trying to give, serve good food, good Yorkshire hospitality, and uh, carry on that philosophy in everything that we do. And then everything that comes on the back of that is a bonus as well. And it, you know, it, it has been good when we got the uh, awarded the Michelin Pub of the Year um, a, a year ago now. That was fantastic, you know, and it does bring extra profile, it brings extra custom in, uh, and it also puts the area on the map as well, which I'm always very proud. Any kind of publicity we get uh, is great because we feel like ambassadors for East Yorkshire as well. And then uh, my day ends by waiting for everybody to go. We clean the kitchen and lock up, which is normally around about 12, half past 12, and then back home to bed, really. And then it, all the day starts again the next day.